I'm headed to cover a couple of officers. Um, they're requesting a supervisor and also a female to the location. Uh, they need um, a female to search one of their female prisoners and then also for me to uh, witness a drug test. The officers may not be trained to test drugs, so when they're not, then they ask for a supervisor to come to the location to, to test the drugs. Here we go. So, you know, basically, I'm just thinking I'm just going over there, you know, test these drugs real quick. They already have the people in custody. And then, you know, search the female, and then I'm done. Straight up, you let the rest the second I pulled him out. Said you got a knife? Yeah, I started reaching for it. I pulled him out of the car, and I saw the pill sitting right there. At that point, I told him, you're under arrest. I put him in handcuffs, mm -hmm. and, you know, for, that's it. The guy at the location pulls out a knife. So they basically pat him down and put him in the squad car, but I still need to search the female. They got the whole car full of nothing but syringes with no caps, some of them filled oh, with God. blood. In this bag, I can't even check it safely. I'm gonna have to just dump it. She's gonna have to get searched. Look, this is just a dip of the iceberg as far as- They got as another bag full of needles Nasty syringes just sitting all over this house. On the hood of the squad car is just all type of paraphernalia and drugs and just, everything and um, the officers are basically like warning me really really quick hey sarge we found all these syringes some still have blood in them be very very careful when you search this female because she could have a syringe on her so at this point you don't have to tell me twice do you have anything on you that can stick me or no. anything like no, that that no that's the only thing that's in there is that needle so nothing, but nothing on you. Yes. You, you sure nothing know on me. Okay. That is like my worst nightmare, being stuck by somebody's dirty needle, not knowing, you know, what's in it or what they have or, uh, Lord. Dump it out on the ground, Gribbon. Yeah, but I gotta pull it up first. I'm just basically like, just, just pour everything out of the purse. I wouldn't even take any chances just digging in the purse with my hands. Is this blood on your pants? Uh, probably, but that's from a What is cut. it from? When I go to search her, I notice blood all over her jeans. So I'm like, wait a minute, hold on. Like, after these officers just told me that, you know, it's still blood in these syringes, and I'm thinking, are you just sticking yourself and it's just blood everywhere? I was just like, totally grossed out. Nothing up here? Mm -hmm. Have you ever been in loose there before? Yes. They could have HIV, AIDS, any disease that, you know, you can or cannot get rid of, and I don't want any of them. Things like this makes you wonder why I wanted to do this. Basically, I'm gonna test these drugs just to, to see if it really is the crystal meth. So I go to the car and get my drug kit, and I get the tester for, for the methamphetamines. This particular drug, if it is crystal meth, then it'll turn blue, or like a bluish purple. It's just a pill. It's just another one of those pills. No, 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 it's quite wrong. That's why I put it there. I think it's just out oh, there's two. There's two. It turned right away. It is very good. See how blue that is? Mm-hmm. That's some of that good stuff. <laughs> it's positive, so all I have to do is fill out the sheet saying it was positive that I tested it all the steps that I went through to test the drugs. That should be so All right. I'll Thank see you all later. Mm -hmm. Thanks for the buzz. I've basically done my part here. I searched the female, I tested the drugs. So these guys can have it. They got this inventory search, they, they can have at it. 